Spirit of Texas Bank, Nissan, Slovacek Sausage, and Germania Insurance bring you this clip of the Texas Bucket List. Well, it's time for the Burger of the Week, and this week we are in McKinney, Texas, at a burger joint that doesn't really have any prominent signs, but I hear they have incredible burgers, one with some really interesting meat. Let's check out Square Burger. It's been said that a square peg could never fit into a round hole. Well, here at Square Burger, there's nothing square about their burgers, and they seem to fit into people's mouths just fine. The burgers are just good. It's fun to come to like a you know, a unique place in McKinney. But there's one burger that's definitely not sheepish. Or is it? They have the best lamb burger I've ever had in my life. It's interesting because it's been one of the most popular burgers from day one. Brandon Horrocks and his buddy Craig Brundage started in the business as dishwashers. Then they rolled the dice on Square Burger in the late 2000s, back when the square in McKinney was starting to become well-rounded. It's kind of like a uh, vision realized, you know. There were a lot of people in McKinney that saw the, you know, the opportunity of the square and what it could be, and, um, and a lot of people stuck by that vision, and it's kind of interesting now to see, it, you know, even not that many years later to see it so different. Just a decade ago, McKinney went through a major makeover. This building was an antique shop. Um, that building was boarded up, that building was boarded up, that building was boarded up. The corner building that's just been renovated was boarded up. Now everything is open and drawing big crowds, including Square Burger. You know, everybody here has got the best um, window watch and seat in town. This place, I really think, adds a lot of character because it's a little bit different, but it's still remaining kind of like with the historic part of McKinney. There are some crazy concoctions at the Square on the Square, including pork chops, lamb chops, and Wagyu prime ribeyes. Seriously, ribeyes? <laughs> I'm here for the burger. <laughs> so are we. That's why we're getting blessed with a burger made from mutton. Uh, have you ever had the lamb burger? No, I heard it tastes kind of bad. <laughs> she just had the lamb burger and she thinks it's... Incredible, absolutely incredible. <laughs> We've heard the opposite, that it tastes... I, I'm, good. I'm sure it does. <laughs> It's definitely a juicy, juicy, delicious burger. Eat with caution. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> we shook our lamb tail twice and got into the kitchen, where the freshly ground meat with garam masala spice got its sizzle on. First for a fleeting moment on the flat grill, and then onto the char grill to get slow cooked. You want a burger like that, you want all the juices to just melt together um, without running out. So the idea is to keep it juicy when it's still there. With a 78-22 fat to lean ratio, the lamb meat gives this burger a lot to savor. Anytime you're doing a burger, you have to have a little bit of that fat in there. It really does um, bring a lot of flavor and keeps it moist and juicy. Pita bread is placed in the oven while tomatoes, onions, and the Greek salad gets geared up to be garnished. Here comes the pita bread. Nice there you time. go. It doesn't take long for the burger to start taking a familiar shape. So right now, it looks like a pita. Yes. And then the lovely lamb is led to the platter. Straight onto the pita? Right onto the pita. Look at that, it fits right on there. Served with a side of tzatziki sauce, house-made tzatziki sauce, there's our lamb burger. All right, let's go give it a try. Okay. And here we have the lamb burger. Beautifully organized and ready to be led into my mouth. Here we go. It only took one, mm. two, mm. three, mm. Four lambs to wow. know I like this burger. Pinch my cottontail and watch me jump twice. That is amazing. The lamb is just the best. I don't know what he seasons it with. I'm gonna find out his secret. Oh, that lamb is juicy. It is a juicy burger. I had, a, <laughs> I, had to, I had to pay for somebody's dry cleaning last week. The way they toast that pita bread in the oven gives it just a great crunchiness, along with that soft lamb meat gives it the perfect contrast. And then the explosion of flavors makes it just go right out of the gate. Mm. Oh, good. You definitely won't feel sheared short with a lamb burger. You just need to get the flock on down to Square Burger. Oh man, because it's just a place to be at. Before you kick the bucket, you have to eat at Square Burger because it is truly, truly the best burger in Texas. Mm -hmm.